Hello there. This is Kevin Allen. I'm the Western Regional Director with Christianity Explored, coming to you from Salem, Oregon, on a beautiful spring day. We know that many of you are indoors um, because of the coronavirus, and uh, we're trying to keep our distance. Alan Avra, our Executive Director uh, from Greenville, South Carolina, is with us, and uh, he's bringing greetings right now as well. So, hello, everybody, from sunny summertime Greenville, South Carolina. But Kevin and I are kind of at two different corners of the country and showing how even across distances we can use virtual technology to be able to join people together for many different things like this training as well as Christianity Explored courses. Very good. Where we want to sh um, show you right now is uh, how to use our Christianity Explored leader site. And uh, this can be found at ChristianityExplored.us. I'm going to draw your attention right here to the, um, to the URL um, entry, ChristianityExplored.us, if you're in the U.S. If you're in Canada, ChristianityExplored.ca. Um, this is our North American site. And on this site, there's some great resources for you. Let me, let me encourage you to look th through this. Um, including an opportunity for you to find your own course and register your course on here. We can talk through more of that at some other point, but we want to draw your attention to how you can log on and make use of the resources at ChristianityExplored.us. So here in the ChristianExplored.us site, there is a number of free tabs that you don't need to log on to get use, uh, to have access to these resources. Uh, the What is Christianity tab, information on each of the courses, how to register your course, about us, uh, donating. Of course, we don't make you log on on that, so we just want you to, um, be able to create your own account there. And, uh, and then this area here, this leaders area, and this is the area we want to highlight today, is our leaders area, because many of you are looking for resources to use in your church, even this weekend, and um, we want to make this available for you. So this leaders area if you clicked on this now, it would send you to a login area where it asks for your login name and password. Another way to get to the login area is this little lock off to the side that I keep pointing to. If you click there, it also goes to the login. And um, if you go here and start going for your login, you can enter your information. If you don't remember your password, which I'm sure there is a number of you um, who don't, um, you can hit the reset password as long as you remember your login name. Um, if you don't remember your login name, you can also use your email address. If for some reason you um, registered with a different email address and don't remember your login name or email address, um, let me encourage you to contact um, either Alan um, or, or me this weekend um, as we're available, and we'd love to share that with you. Um, if you contact the folks in London, it might be until next Thursday that they'll get back to you. And so uh, we want to make that available. Um, if you are having problems logging on, we want to help you there. But uh, if you do remember, um, this is where your email address or name go in, um, your login name and your password. Any thoughts on that, Alan? No, that, that's good. Just contact us if you have trouble. Great. And our contact information will be at the bottom of this email that you received this information for. So we're going to hit login here. And when you do, you see you now have access to this leaders tab and all kinds of great information here, um, including um, just a welcome from us, um, resources from all um, of the different resources we have. Um, evangelism training is available online here as well um, in brief. Um, and so these are here for you. But what we want to highlight is the resources that are available under each course. We want to start off with Christianity Explored. It's our most popular course, and um, we have the most resources under that. Um, but what you do is when you choose your course, the main area to go is this little play button right underneath there. So let's go to Christianity Explored, look at this, click this play button and uh, look at what's here. So now that we're in the Christianity Explored Leaders area, um, it really emphasizes how flexible Christianity Explored it can be. It can be obviously run at a course at church if you are able to get to church, uh, but 
the nice thing is this is flexible for being able to be able to run online um, in a small group settings and in different settings as well. So even in the midst of this, uh, we have some um, resources available. We also want to highlight um, the watch and share feature here in just a second. I'll come right back to this. But before we do, also want to provide you um, with these resources. Um, there are um, course PDFs and documents here, information mostly on, mostly on our training, how to set up the course, our eight training modules, uh, the talk, talk outlines, the supporting resources, these are feedback forms, tools, <coughs> and more. Um, on top of that, there are some promotional downloads for you can use in your church and um, promotional media files, basically our trailers um, and and an introduction for that for others on that. Um, so that will help you a little bit. We'll talk about the children and youth versions a little later. But these are here. The main thing we want to show you right now, and I think the number one thing driving people to our leader site, are the is the flexibility of being able to share these videos. So I clicked on episode one, good news, and um, right here you have a couple of different options. You can watch the video. I can hit play right now and start watching it. Let's try that. Um, and I'm not be able to do that right now because probably because of the middle of streaming this other stuff. Um, you can download them. You can share the, the video um, with people. So let's say you've got a group of people in your church or your entire church that you want to share this with. Here is a link for you to share this. You can grab this file, this link right here, copy and paste it, email it, and, uh, and or put it on a website. This is yours uh, to, to be able to give out. The idea behind this is that your church has purchased a Christian Explorer DVD at some point. Um, but that's the sharing. In addition, um, you should be able to download this video as well. So let me restart the screen see if that works for us. So anyway, the idea of sharing the video, if you wanted to run a uh, Christianity Explored course virtual over this weekend or the coming week while we're social distancing, one way you can do this is by sharing these videos and then people can watch the videos and you can have the group discussion virtually online with a uh, uh, Zoom, Amazon Chime, or various other kinds of uh, meeting uh, applications. This is a great resource for you um, in that regard. So, yeah, and all of those uh, videos are right there. So um, there's also under the three dots here, there should be a download for downloading the, the video locally. There are times where a higher number of people are going to be streaming this at the same time. We're especially concerned about Sunday mornings. Um, and, uh, and so let me encourage you, if you can download it ahead of time and have a local copy, you will alleviate um, streaming issues. And you might encourage your folks to go ahead and click these three little dots off to the right and download that. So that's our Christianity Explored. In a similar way, we're going to see the same thing with um, Life Explored and, um, and Discipleship Explored as well. A number of churches are using the time... Um, that they are unable to meet to go through Discipleship Explored uh, with their congregation. It's a great opportunity to, um, to have an online curriculum that's well done. Um, there is an um, opportunity to go through that with Bible Mesh as well, um, but I think they, there's a small charge for that. Um, they have an online uh, resource. Their Christian Explored on Bible Mesh is free. Let's look at Life Explored uh, just briefly. In our um, Life Explored, area, we have um, each of these videos as well. So Overture, you have the two um, Overture videos. Um, this is the original um, film, and then the teaching film follows. And like with the Christianity Explored one, you can download this right here. You can also share both videos with this link right here. Uh, so both films are available on here, um, um, and we'd love for you to, to send up that link. Um, right now, you cannot download the first film, but only the second film, um, for some reason. That's just the way things are. 
Um, but the watch and share there. And then also, these are amazing resources in regards to um, Life Explored are the session commentaries. I recommend that everyone going through um, Life Explored look at the, the goal of the course or the goal of that week um, with Life Explored with some of the authors of it, um, uh, Nate Morgan Locke and Barry Cooper, who wrote the, the Life Explored material, explain their goal in each week. Um, also, their questions and answers are there. Again, course downloads, promotional materials, and media files again. Alan, anything else about Life Explored? Yeah, I would just reiterate, this is great for uh, training your leaders to be able to use Life Explored. And Life Explored probably needs a little more explanation to the leaders than Christianity Explored. So these are the resources that can help. And the commentaries in particular, and these and and the questions answered are uh, very um, helpful. I found for um, for churches going through this. Continuing on in our leaders area, uh, we have discipleship explored. Discipleship explored is actually our newest course that came out. Was it two years ago now, Alan? Um, yeah, that's actually I think the third edition of discipleship explored, but it's completely revised in this edition. Right, and this was about two years ago. And yeah. again, you have the author commentaries, which are very helpful each for each week. And again, uh, the watching and sharing of these resources. And again, you can share the v resource, and you can download that um, as an MP4. So I highly encourage you to take a look there. Um, we would love to put those on there as well for you, um, just as a, as a good resource. Um, and in addition to Christian Explored, Life Explored, and Discipleship Explored, we have our children and youth material. This has recently been added to the leader site. Um, Alan, explain to us what the children and youth um, area has in it. So the Christianity Explored course we have for all age groups. So the youth and children's versions use the gospel according to Mark, just like the uh, adult version of Christianity Explored. Epic Explorers is for uh, elementary school age children, uh, ages four to 11. It's a uh, five session format. There's plenty of material, very flexible. It's used in home groups and uh, Bible clubs, as well as vacation Bible school. Then CY is the middle school version. And uh, that one uh, really is good at helping not only non-Christian kids, but Christian kids address the faith identity issues that they're dealing with in the middle school age when they're trying to decide if this faith they've grown up in is going to be their own. And then Soul is a resource for uh, senior highs and, and young adults, but it is uh, a great evangelistic resource for uh, people in your church, particularly students in your church, to invite their friends. And I could see any of these being used during this time period when kids are away from uh, school and you're looking not just for the school assignments that they have to do, but looking for things uh, when they can't get to their church youth group or children's ministries, that you can use these uh, remotely to uh, have the uh, uh, students go through. Yes, and two notes along those lines. One, um, people often ask if there's a video component to Epic Explorers, and there is not. Um, and the CY resources uh, use the Soul DVD. Um, and so the videos here for Soul work with CY as well. The second thing I'd love to point out is if you are a um, youth leader and wanting to challenge your, um, your youth group at home during this time, one thing that is available on this leader site is the Mark Challenge, and it's to challenge the group members to read through uh, Mark's Gospel. And so that's a wonderful resource, especially as we believe that the best way uh, to share the Gospel is through the Gospel itself. And so I want to encourage you to look at all the resources that are on there, but those in particular are, are be very flexible. The Mark Challenge is available both uh, for CY and for Soul. So... That's our leader site. Uh, there's a ton of other stuff on here, but we want to honor your time. If you have questions, we're available. Our resource, um, our, our resource as far as our phone numbers and emails are at the bottom of the email. And uh, we hope 
and pray for you, that you stay safe, um, that your family stay safe, and that you can enjoy some special time with family um, during this time where God has stripped us of uh, many of the other things that distract us in life. And uh, and so, Alan, um, final thoughts? Well, we would just encourage you. I mean, we understand this time is a great challenge, but it's also, you know, see the flip side of the challenge is the opportunity. It's an opportunity to think outside the box, way to use virtual uh, meeting resources. And also it's a time to be bold because people uh, maybe are thinking about issues that they don't normally think in the busyness of everyday life. So in some ways, uh, people have had some things stripped away from them and maybe realizing you know, the need for uh, really considering uh, who are they and what's their purpose in life? Why were they made? Why are they here? What is the future? So yeah, we are praying for you as you make the most of the of the days, um, as we're called to do. Well, on behalf of Christianity Explored, we are thrilled that you spend time with us today, and uh, thank you for the attention. Please contact us with questions. Um, and we look forward to to hearing from you and to hear how you've used these resources. Have a great day. Thanks. Okay. Thank you.